In informal settlements worldwide, poverty and plastic waste are deeply interconnected challenges. With over a billion people living in substandard housing, many lack access to proper sanitation facilities, impacting their health, dignity, and safety. At the same time, plastic waste piles up, clogging waterways and polluting communities. These settlements often rely on makeshift structures that cannot withstand harsh weather, leaving residents vulnerable and in perpetuating cycles of poverty. But what if we could turn this plastic waste into opportunity and contribute to the challenge of access to affordable housing through building materials made from recycled plastic waste? We can empower communities, reduce poverty, and create jobs while transforming informal settlements into safer, healthier places to live. Introducing the Manufacturing Box, a self-sustaining microfactory that converts plastic waste into building bricks, thereby supporting communities in creating jobs, bricks to build houses, and reducing plastic waste simultaneously. Our solution is inspired by the EduBox, developed by the Humanitarian Engineering Group at the University of Twente, and a current project of Engineers Without Borders NL and Trashmart. Here is how it works. Plastic wastes get collected at schools or by local waste pickers. PVC gets sorted out by hand, the remainders get shredded and cleaned. The, shred the cleaned plastic shreds get melted and mixed together. This mixture will be molded into bricks using compression molding. The entire system runs on solar energy. The bricks produced in the manufacturing box can be used for proper housing in informal settlements or build washrooms for schools in the local communities and with this provide education on the value of waste and create better sanitation. The self-sustained microfactory will create job opportunities, generate a local waste management system and educate people on waste being a source of material and not just litter, creating a self-sustaining and a self-improving loop. The recycled plastic bricks are the cornerstone of the manufacturing box. Using CAD software, the bricks have been carefully designed to use as little plastic as possible. Only 1.3 kilograms of plastic waste per brick. The bricks are manufactured using low cost and low tech machinery and laser cut molds, suitable for the solar powered shipping container factories. Through compression molding simulations, we optimize the production process, ensuring that every brick is efficiently molded with minimal material waste. Our team conducts stress simulations to guarantee that these bricks are not only lightweight, but also capable of withstanding structural loads for projects like housing and school washrooms. Lighter bricks means less strain, enabling a safer and healthier work environment for construction workers. The interlocking design of the bricks allows for a quick and easy building process, which has been tested using 3D printed prototypes. The manufacturing box also has gone through various iterations and manufacturing simulations to ensure efficient layouts and optimal tap distribution enabling a high throughput of only 4 minutes per brick. The costs for setting up a microfactory are estimated at a small 15,000 euros, a significant but accessible amount for local entrepreneurs. Our solution will have impact on several of the sustainable development goals. By using these bricks to build washrooms for schools, we have an impact on gender equality, since more girls will be able to attend school when proper sanitation is available. This proper sanitation in and outside of schools will also have an impact on clean water and sanitation. Furthermore, the manufacturing box will create decent work and job opportunities, which turns into economic growth in underserved communities impacting SDG 8 and 9. The recycled plastic bricks sustainably produced will help build inclusive, safe, resilient and sustainable communities. By improving gender equality, building better sanitation, creating decent work and job opportunities, contributing to economic growth and creating sustainable communities, this solution is a small step towards achieving the Sustainable Development Goal number one, ending poverty, brick by brick.